Hey everybody, thanks for tuning in again today. And today we're going to do a cheese board covered in resin. Now the resin I use is food safe, but make sure you check yours before starting this project. I'll make sure to link my resin in the comments below. So the first thing I did was mix a big batch of resin up according to the instructions on the back of my resin, and then I separated it into five cups. From there, I added my pigments. I used high flow acrylic, regular heavy body acrylic, some mica flakes, and then some powdered pigments. You can really use anything you want as long as it doesn't go over 10% by volume to the resin. So next I mixed a few of my colors in a cup and started pouring it on the board. At this point, what you're really wanting to do is just cover the board and you can really work on design later. Um, here you can see that I am using my hand Please don't do what I do. My gloves got really sticky, so I took them off and then I had resin all over my hands. Now my resin is food safe and I don't react to it, but your resin might be different. So again, gloves, respirator, and safety precautions at all times. So you can add a design however you want. I'm doing blues to look like an ocean and I'm about to add some white to look like waves. You add the blowtorch to the white or to any area to help create a lacing effect. And I pick my board up and I twist it around and that really enhances the lacing. And you can again do that with any color of your choosing. I just like to make it white. And this is about all that you need to learn how to do this tutorial. If you have any questions or any more details, comment them in the comments below. Links to the products I used in the description, and please don't forget to hit subscribe. Until next time, guys.